hello guys and welcome back so now in this video we will be adding sound effects and also a health system to our player and opponent as well so for sound effects i'm using this free asset which is by the name of free deadly combat this is the creator name daniel sounds code okay this is a free asset so go ahead and search for it on unity asset store and download it then click on open unity editor and it will open this up right here click on import and then simply import it okay so here it is now we have the sound effects now go ahead and open up the fighting controller script and on the fighting controller script right here in the effects and sounds what we're gonna do now is we're gonna create a public audio clip by the name of hit sounds okay this will be an array because we will be playing a random sounds okay not a single sound then we can scroll down to the player head damage and right here let's play a random hit sound so we will say if hit sounds is not null and Hit sounds dot length is greater than zero. Then we will create an integer by the name of random index, which will be equals to random dot range. Let's pass zero to it and then hit sounds dot length. Okay, after that we will say audio source dot play clip at point and the point where we hit sounds random index and then transform dot position. That's it. This will play the sound now let's add health as well because we have the health comment next right here after this hit sound what we're gonna do we're gonna create a new header by the name of health in here create a public integer by the name of max health or maximum health which will be 100 right then create another integer this will be current health okay then after this in the awake method set the current health to the maximum health then scroll down right here where we have the comment what we're gonna do is we will say current health minus equals to take damage so as you know that to this take damage we pass a value from our opponent AI okay right here we pass a take damage and a take damage is 5 so 5 will be passed to this and then current health will be minus by 5 every time the player takes damage okay so if the current health is 100 the player takes damage it will be 95 if the player take damage again it will be 90 and in that way it will it will keep decreasing okay then we will say that if the current health becomes less than or equals to zero then in this case what we're gonna do we're gonna for now uh, just simply call a method die and then create our die method so in this die method we will just simply print a message that player died okay for now we don't have the result screen or any code for it in which we show you lose or you win so for now we just gonna show player died okay so this will now play the sound effect and show the health now let's do the same for the opponent as well okay so if I scroll up right here let me copy this four things 
from there get back right here and right after the attack for effect paste it then get back right here again copy that and paste it in the awake then scroll down okay we have this player head damage animation and the die method so let's copy both of these two and where it is let me find it. okay right here player head damage so just remove this and paste that again okay so now everything is set up right here we just need to type opponent die instead of player die now if you get back right here click on eddy here it is current health maximum health hit sound so now for the hit sound if you go in there we will uh, add these first three sounds you can add how many sounds you want but i'm gonna just add three so one two three okay i'm adding the body hit small body hit small body hit small 23 okay i'm just adding these three now let's add these three to the opponent as well so drag and drop it one by one in the hit sound area right here Alright, that's it. Now if you go ahead and play the game and let's click on Eddy, you will notice current health is 100 when the game starts. Now you will notice the sound effect and as you can see the current health is now 95. Okay, now 90 and it plays the sound as well. Now if I click on Jin Kazama, its health is 100. Now if I try to hit him, it plays the effect and the health is decreased as you can see okay so it works perfectly fine now the sound effects and the health system as well we can now damage the player play the sound effect and with all of these done our fighting controller for the player and for the opponent is completed now in the upcoming video what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a few characters for player and few characters for our opponent okay so with this turn see you guys in the next one